pancakes. God, I've been ages getting motivated to do this. So I've got me a frying pan, I've got my little stove. It's just to make a video, of course. So I've sorted the ingredients out, which are quite simple. And so, we'll have a go, eh? And see what we come up with. Right. I seem to have a lot of milk, but I've gone with the recipe. It says 100 grams of flour. I've set that out already. So that goes in your mixing bowl. 100 grams of flour. And you make a hole in, you've got to sift the droppers, a pinch of salt. Right, so we only want a tiny bit, we've got some salt, look. That's too much. Well, that's plenty of salt. So, we mix that up together. break an egg into a cup first. Why do you do that? Well in case it's rotten or you get the shell in or anything. There we are. Right. Now ideally we need to whisk the egg up first. It doesn't tell you that bit, but I actually know that bit. So we'll do it with a fork. Right, there's the egg look in there, can you see? Just without me spurning it. Yeah. So, we whisk the egg up. Like that. And that goes in the middle, like that, with half the milk. That's what the recipe says. So, we'll, we'll do what the recipe says. Although, uh, it's a long, long, long time since I made pancakes, but this doesn't actually seem quite right, but anyway, we will, we will see, won't we? <coughs> oh, it's got to be a bit runny. But we will see. It may or may not be. Anyway, I've got the mixing bowl. I've got everything cleaned up. Oh, it's, it might be working, actually. It just might. Might do it. Right, I've got to beat this until there's no lumps in it, so this takes quite a while, normally. And it's out making. Got to be smooth. That's the only thing, you mustn't have lumps in it. Oh, we might be alright actually. Just might be alright. We'll try it to see. Ah. That's got me more stuck to this mixing bowl than what I've got to use, but that doesn't matter. I've got plenty. This seems, uh, hmm. I don't know. Sticking to the side of the bowl more than lumps in the side, but I'm not worried about that. I'm worried about having no lumps in the butter. <coughs> <coughs> right. See how we get on, eh? It's coming on, look. Can you see? Look, we're getting there. It does take a while, though. It does. So, we'll see how we go on. So, like this. 
Oh, I just haven't had motivation to do it for some reason or other. I'm struggling today, but uh, I've just got to make the effort, haven't I? Hey? Got to make the effort. Anyway, we're getting all the lumps out of it. That's all that matters. It's important. This is the only hard bit of the whole job. Right. Now we put the rest of the milk in, or some of it. And mix that in. I made pancakes in the past, I'm sure the batter wasn't this thin, but anyway. We'll do what it says and see. Doesn't matter, does it? Maybe be alright. We'll know soon enough. There we are. We'll know soon enough. Actually, it might be, might be doing it. We'll try it and see. You don't have any more, can we? Hey, you got to laugh if nothing else. Right. Well, that's well beaten up anyway. I'm going to put it in this jug. Whenever you do anything, doesn't matter what it is, whenever you do anything at all, I've been quite on what I've done this by the way in the first instance, it's called setting your stall out. It's quite important to do. I used to do it at work. And uh, get organised before you start, it makes the job an awful lot easier. Of course, stick this in the fridge for half an hour and let it stand. We're not going to do it that way. You can do it straight away. But anyway, we'll, we'll do that. They don't take very long, you see, that's the thing with these. Right, well, that's mixed up well. Now, what we have to do is you have a bit, bit of melted butter or oil. I've got oil. So what we'll do is tip a little bit in the pan, like that, and swirl it round. And in fact, better idea. I'll use this. And I'll add it with this. There we are. And then I can, uh, I can drop that in that mixing bowl and get another one because there's a little tiny bit too much in here still. Just wipe it, the excess out. There you are. That's it. And then got any on the top of that. Right. Well, we're about ready to have a go, I think. So, we turn the stove on and put the pan to heat up. It won't take long. Or it shouldn't take long. So anyway, um, got everything prepared at last. First time I've used this pan, of course. I only got it for this. Just to make a video of making pancakes, how about that? Got a lot of pancakes. Right, 
Now you have to wait for the pan to get it needs to be hot. Right, it does need to be hot. So we have to just wait until the pan heats up now. Uh, while I'm doing that, we can get a plate out to put it on when it's done, can we? And, a little thing, we can wipe this little bit up that's spilt. Good little one mess. Oh, the whole job's easy, you see. Anyway, I've got a little bit of smoke coming off it now. That should be hot enough. Should just about be hot enough. And what you do, you pour it in and swirl it round like that. There we are. take very long. In fact that's done. Put the pan a little bit hot actually, not to worry. Uh, should have we're getting there. It's supposed to be non-stick, you see. Which it is, but I'll just turn the stove down a bit. Oh, yeah. Right. I should have. There we are, it's free. Flip it over. A little bit brownish, but it's alright. So, we're getting there. Not quite. A little bit more. Well, it shouldn't take quite as long as this, so maybe I want to turn that up a tiny bit. No, oh, nearly done. The other side's right. There we are. That's how it should look. On the other side, you see. That's it. And that's done. So, put it on a plate. Like that. This I'll have to put on the drain board. I'll not leave that spoon on there. Turn the stove out. And we want a tiny bit of orange juice on, which we've already got. Fresh orange juice, that's why I've got to do it today, because we've had this one. And a tiny drop. Just a tiny drop of fresh orange juice on it. And a little bit of sugar. I like sugar on mine. Some people have salt. I like sugar on mine. Now, a bit of sugar. There we are, look. One pancake. And actually, it's good. Mm. Even though I say myself. Mm. 
Hmm. Well, after all that, I'm pleased to report it's actually successful. Another easy, but remember it's the first time that I've made it with this stove and pan and that. I made a few, got me better. Bet you not yet have a tape. I can do you another one then. And that. Right. I'm going to put the rest of the batter in the fridge. Enough for days, but. Then a little bit later I can have some more. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, something a little bit different, let's say. See you soon.